now you've unpacked and set up your new Eon Jellyfish system as explained in part one of this series. Whoa, whoa, hold your horses there, partner. Your tank isn't ready for animals yet. Your system has to cycle first. Cycling is one of the most important steps in the whole process. No, no, no. Nitrogen cycling. Your system needs to establish stable nitrogen levels in the water. Establishing a stable community of helpful bacteria in your tank is essential to the health of both your system and your jellies. All you need is a bacteria source, a saltwater test kit, and an ammonia source, in this case, shrimp. First, place a pea-sized piece of the shrimp on top of your mechanical filter pad, underneath the drip tray. Give your bacteria a good shake and pour about three ounces down the filter box and let the cycling begin. This is where your test kit comes in handy. You'll need to check your water chemistry every week to monitor your system's progress. Hmm, maybe this would be more helpful in color. Ah, that's better. After one week, there won't be much change. By week two, we should see a spike in ammonia. During the third week, we see the ammonia start to fall while the nitrite begins to spike. And finally, after about four weeks, your system's bacteria have eaten up all the ammonia and nitrite. So congratulations, your tank is ready for jellies. If you'd like some help with the process, visit sunsetmarinelab.com and click the black banner to sign up for our fishless cycling program. If you successfully cycle your tank through our program, you'll receive three jellies. Our customer service team is standing by to help you through the process step by step.